kids it's miss katie with crafts with katie so this is uh kind of our spring break edition because everyone's on spring break yay spring so um we actually had a few package pickups that you could have gotten at the library um we had um we have littles for little package and then we had some middle packages for more of school age and we also had an older kid teen craft so this was our teen craft uh, that you could have picked up it is a felt succulent is what it's called so you take the felt and you make a succulent and with a cute little pot and it's a cute little decoration and then the middle one was what I was calling a swirl jar because when you look at it like this, it's just plain, right? But then when you give it a really good shake, it's got all that glitter in there. So it's all like sparkly and fun. And then you can just watch the glitter swirl all around. It's very calming, very relaxing. So that was that. And then this one is what I'm going to show you today. It was our little craft. It's um kind of like a spring hanger you can hang it on your door or on a window or anywhere that you think it would look lovely so we've sent home all these things for you to add to your hanger um, so I'm going to show you kind of how to put that together so right here I have a really big piece of cardboard to show you what you will do on your littler ones so First, you're going to take your cardboard and I've already dumped out some glue here I like using a brush to brush it on with if you want to use your hands you sure can just remember to wipe them before you touch your tissue paper otherwise everything's gonna stick to you so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna take our glue that's really runny and we're just gonna brush it you can brush it all over the whole thing it doesn't dry super fast uh, liquid glue so um, you can brush it over the whole thing and make sure you get it all covered otherwise your tissue paper is not going to stick so once you've got it all covered you're going to take in your little package there was a bunch of tissue paper so now you're going to take your tissue paper and you're just going to put it on and you can put it on in any pattern you want. You can put one half, all one color. You can make it spotted. You can use any colors you want that's in that package. If you have tissue paper at home that you want to use, that's a different color, you go right ahead. Just ask your parent or uh, an adult for help. And yeah, so then you just make sure that it's all covered. So also with this, um, if you want to go back and do a second layer, like say you've done this and you want to do another layer on top of it, you have to make sure that it's all dry first before you try and do a second layer. Otherwise, it's just going to get too wet with glue and it's just going to, it's actually going to wreck your tissue paper. It'll just rip and tear it. So once you've got that all flattened down you can see there's a few that aren't that aren't really sticky so if you do have a brush you can take it and just put a little bit of glue on it and just brush down your edges that way it just it all sticks really well you just have to be a little careful a little gentle but uh, yeah and then once you've got that done then you could add there was a few things in your package we included some little foamy things like flowers or butterflies in your little package um, so if you have these you can just use a little bit of glue and uh, a little bit of extra glue and you can just decide where you want to put it and just stick it on and then we also added in there um, some flowers, some pretty, pretty flowers. So 
um, as you can see, this flower has a little tiny knob on it. So what I'm actually gonna get you to do is cut that off. It makes it easier to glue it on. So you just cut that little knob thingy off and see how it's all flat now. If you need help with that, make sure to ask for help, okay? It is a little tough to cut off. So you're just gonna put some glue down again and you can put your flowers on. And it makes the most lovely springtime decoration, Easter decoration, so bright and colorful and lovely. And yeah, so that is what it will turn out like. Now, like I said, you can go back and fill it in. You can do both sides, make it really pretty. And yeah, just have a lot of fun with it. So yeah, if you guys do it, I'd love to see some pictures. I always love seeing what you guys can create. And we will talk to you soon. Bye.